Go code. Hmm, this is a weird file. Answer password. There's an instance of the service running on Mercury. Okay, we'll connect to that. Mercury PicoCTF.net 21.540. I asked for a password. It just seems to have locked up. All right, so we'll open this up in Ghidra. And there's the main program. There's a function for checking the password, function called ambush. Let's look at check password. When we check the password, we see long string here, 8618, etc., string of hexadecimal digits. And it looks like it's being exclusive ORed with it and then compared to local 20. I don't see local 20 anywhere. Yeah, I don't know what local 20 is. So I'm going to open this up in a debugger. And I'm going to try and debug that. So we'll look at the assembly to find an address in order to run the debugger. So we'll put a stop somewhere around 80D4B30. So we'll do GDB dot dot enter password break 0x. What I say? 80 D4B30. Okay, so we'll run that. We need a password. It looks like the password needs 32 characters long. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 31, 32. Okay, <laughs> I hit my breakpoint and I want to look at the stack pointer plus 4 and plus 24. Let's do a hex stump byte sp plus 4. Okay, so there is that string that I reverse engineered. And the rest of that should be the thing that I need to XOR Warith. All right, so we're going to go into Python here. I'm going to use pwn tools, put in that value, and I'm going to unhex that using the pwn tools library, and then that string that I reverse engineered, we exclusive or them and print them. Python go go dot py. Reverse engineering, I can barely forward. So we'll netcat put in that. What is the unhashed key? Some MD5 or something somewhere. We can see that in ambush. So the MD5 sum, then I'm going to compare it to that exact same string that I saw before. So I have that exact same string. I'm going to ask Google, we can find the MD5 sum on the internet where someone else has solved it, and there it is. For successfully reversed to the string goldfish. So we'll NCAT again, reverse engineering I can barely forward, goldfish, and there's the key, Pika Pika.